Hi, Namaste all. Welcome to Service Now India. Today's topic is assignment lookup rules and what is the significance of it. Like these are the lookup rules in Service Now which are used to automatically assign a task to a user or a group based upon some defined conditions. Like we define the conditions before uh, setting up the rules. And these are majorly used in incident module, change module, problem module. And to streamline the assignment logic without any scripting part, like without uh, defining any script. And these are majorly uh, fine, like to assign a particular group or to assign to a user should be populated on the task record or any incident record. And where we find them, like we need to navigate for system policy and rules and assignment lookup rules. The backend name of this assignment lookup rules table is sys underscore auto underscore assignment. Let's move on to PDA and show you how to create this assignment lookup rules and how to uh, execute them. Like how we'll see how to execute them in the real time. Click on filter navigator. As I said that type assignment lookup rules. And under system policy, under rules, we have assignment lookup rules. Click on this module and you can see we don't have any records till now on this assignment data lookup rules and we are trying to create a new custom one. Click on new button. My requirement is when a category of ticket is software and subcategory is email, then automatically this incident should be assigned for a group called software group. And in that, we need to select as something called Beth Angelin as he, she is part of the group called software okay and the order value is referred for the least value executes first and highest value executes in the last just click on submit and then we can check this in the incident form click on filter navigator incident dot do and you can see like we have created a new record the next tab and select the caller name and I select as category as software and subcategory as email. Then you can see like automatically these two values are filled based out of this category and subcategory. This is the main usage of the assignment lookup rules. Based out of this category and subcategory and service and service offering and configuration item. These can be managed by using or assigned by using these values. You can see like if I click on the existing one. Like category, subcategory, configuration item and location based out of these things we can assign for a group along with for a user. I'll just go with another example like uh, with, with a different example. I'll just mention like some email issue here like for saving purpose. And I'm creating a new one here. Go back for the assignment data lookup rules. And I'm creating another example. Click on new button. And you may have doubt that where we uh, uh, mentioned the table name here. I said that it works for majorly the incident problem chain, the task table. We don't need to mention any table here. Okay. Like select as category as hardware and hardware go with keyboard and assignment should be like hardware and just go for Fred Lodi. If a user selects category as hardware and subcategory as keyboard, then automatically the ticket should assign for hardware and to the group and along with this user. And I am mentioning as 100 as default order value. Just click on submit and check once in the incident form. Go for incident and just remove this part and just mention as minus one for creating a new record. As minus one refers for creating a new record. And select the caller name as you want any caller name. Like select the category as hardware and subcategory as keyboard. Then you can see like automatically these two values are filled based out of this category and subcategory. This is the main usage like 
it can help the service desk operators or service desk team to reduce the number of clicks and maintain the streamline like how many uh, like depending upon category and subcategory automatically they will assign the tickets towards the respective groups okay yeah that's it for today jai hind